Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Ed Knight. I'm the general counsel of NASDAQ OMX, and we're pleased to welcome the University of Texas at Austin Global Venture Labs Investment Competition today, and Visolis, the 2013 Global Champion. They're going to ring today's closing bell right here from the crossroads of the world in Times Square, New York. Visolis is one of 40 teams from 11 countries that competed in this year's competition. And like many other teams from top graduate programs from around the globe, Visolis shares a passion for innovation and a vision and leadership that inspires everyone that comes in contact with this team. We are so excited to have them here today. You are like so many of the companies on NASDAQ, and we hope someday you will be on NASDAQ. So let's have a round of applause for Visolis. This uh, competition began at the University of Texas, uh, and I graduated from the University of Texas, I'll come back to me in a second, by MBA students in 1984. The Venture Labs Investment Competition is the oldest venture competition in the world, and the event provides graduate students with a chance to simulate the real world uh, process of raising venture capital, which is a tough process. And 2013 marks the 11th consecutive year that the global champion has closed the market at NASDAQ. And we're very proud to be associated with this Super Bowl of the World Business Plan competition. Visolis is developing a very exciting product. It is the next generation of biocatalysts that can convert renewable feedstocks into chemicals and fuels at a price point that is competitive with petroleum-based processes. The team from the Indian School of Business will offer a way to reduce the environmental impact of sustainable alternatives and create sustainable alternatives to petroleum-based products for a wide range of industries. So this is a, a real uh, uh, game-changing type of innovation, and we're very proud to be associated with it. Companies like Visolis are championing the kind of innovative thinking and entrepreneurial spirit that will continue to lift our global economy and our nation. Congratulations to them and we wish you continued success. I want to say a word about me, though, in the University of Texas. I wouldn't be here if it weren't for the University of Texas. I was an undergraduate student there. I uh, graduated from their law school. I paid the grand sum of $250 a semester to go to law school there, and uh, the alumni at UT uh, got jobs for many of the law students in Washington, and one of those jobs led to uh, uh, me working for Lloyd Benson, another graduate of UT of UT and he became my mentor and it's all history. So I am very proud to be part of the tradition at the University of Texas. I owe them a lot. I try to pay back wherever I can and we're glad uh, to have them here, the members of this competition and the people from uh, uh, that uh, developed the product uh, and the team from uh, uh, Visola. So please join me in welcoming Rob Warren who's the director of the Venture Labs Investment Competition uh, and Rob Adams to the, to the podium. Thanks, Mr. Knight. On behalf of the University of Texas, I just want to say thank you very much to NASDAQ for having us back for the 11th year in a row. Your contribution makes this competition really what it is. It gives our, our winner a chance to showcase what they can do on a global stage. I also want to thank our supporters that are out today, in particular Accenture and Wells Fargo, who've come to, uh, come to New York City for our board meeting this afternoon. And I'll finally, I want to thank all of the judges and other supporters of the Venture Labs Investment Competition who've come to New York to support our winner, Vesolis. For our 30th anniversary of this competition, we went global. 40% of all of our competitors were global. 50% of those who appeared in the finals were global. But most importantly, our winner is global. And nowhere is that seen more in the fact that they're from the Indian School of Business. They won their birth to Texas by winning the Asia Venture Competition in Bangkok, and their company is global in its focus from the start. Based in the US, going to do business in Brazil, using people from all around the world. They truly represent what we're after at the Global Venture Labs Competition, and it gives me great pleasure in asking Vesolis to come to the stage now to say a few words.
Thank you, Rob. Thank you, Texas Venture Labs, and thank you, NASDAQ, for providing us with this incredible opportunity. We are humbled to be here. This journey would not have been possible without the support of our families, our friends, and our mentors. The Visolis team, Aditya Jain, Ashish Kohli, Akshat Piper Senior, Amrita Datta, and myself, Deepak Dugar, would like to thank the Indian School of Business for their unwavering support, especially the senior staff and the faculty members. I would also like to recognize Mass CEC, New England Clean Energy Council, the Martin Family Society for Sustainability, and the Ligatum Fellowship at MIT for supporting the initial work. At Visolis, we remain committed to building a sustainable future, and we hope to be back here on this podium. Thank you.